Hi, it's Peter here from Mad Max Movies. I'm just doing a quick review for you today on a couple of the companion books that were released with Mad Max Fury Road. Uh, as you can see, we've got on the left here, we've got the Inspired Artists book, and on the right is the Art of Mad Max Fury Road. Now, the first thing you notice is the, um, the, the, the art of book was quite a lot larger than I expected it to be. The Inspired Artists book is um, it's by comic book artists. It's actually about comic book size. Uh, for a comparison, we've got the latest issue of Street Machine here, also featuring Fury Road. This gives you a bit of an idea of the size of the two books when you look at them next to each other. Anyway, let's take a look inside. Okay, we've opened up the Inspired Artists book for you first. Like I said, front and back cover there. We'll just have a, have a quick look inside. You can see it's basically a lot of conceptual art yeah, you know, images by yeah, you know, interpretations from comic book artists of yeah, you know, their interpretation of the vehicles in the film, the characters in the film. Uh, it's yeah, you know, purely an art book. As you can see, we're just I'm just flicking through a few random pages here. I don't want to show you the whole thing, but yeah, if if you're into the world of Mad Max and a, a bit of art, and it, obviously they're very visual films. Hopefully you'd enjoy this one. There's some great images in here, a lot yeah. You know, you know, a lot of artwork here from obviously professional comic book artists who are as big of the fans of the film as well. So yeah, it's really interesting to see their interpretations and um, yeah, take a further look into the world of you know what might have happened or you know, how else it might have looked. Okay, now let's take a look at the art of Mad Max Fury Road. Now I know the, the title implies art, uh, which we would think maybe end up being a fairly similar book to the comic book artist book that we've just looked at. Um, this is in fact a much more in-depth, behind the scenes look at everything, every aspect of the making of the film. Um, if you want to know the film in intricate detail, this is going to be the book for you. Um, I'll just flick through a few of the opening pages here. So you can see the, um, just some of the, you know, the, the opening title type artwork new contents pages and so on. You can see already, you know, some of the art that's represented in here. So this is some of the conceptual art. Now, if we move to the, yeah, you know, to the Ford, and we see George Miller there. Um, you know, a lovely introduction from, from the director. As you progress through the book though, you'll quickly see, this is more than just photos and storyboards. We've got synopsis from the film. We've got background discussion. We've got behind the scenes photos of vehicles under construction, you know, construction storyboards, you know, everything laid out. This, this is how the film was made. It's um, a very in-depth book. There's plenty of text describing it all in detail. There's just, there's literally thousands of photos in here. You know, storyboards, the whole, the whole lot, conceptual art. If you want a background into how the film was made and you want to see this film in depth, this is just an exceptional book for fans, I think. Um, I don't want to show you again too much, but hopefully just what we're flicking through here you know, gives you an idea of what, you know, what the content of this book entails. Um, you know, again, everything from concept to finished pr you know, production. Um, fantastic book. I'm not sure what else to tell you without giving you too much away, but yeah, it's, I think if you're a fan of the film, you will not be disappointed at all uh, with what you receive here. So yeah. Hopefully that um, gives you a bit of an insight into the two books that have been released. Feel free to drop a comment in below or drop by the website and throw me a question if there's anything else you'd like to know or see.